the script would continue to weave this narrative of faith, trust, and victory, encouraging the listener to stand firm in their beliefs, to declare with confidence their readiness to reclaim what is rightfully theirs emboldened by the Holy Spirit within. It would speak to the heart of the listener, urging them to embrace the truth that they are supported by forces far greater than any opposition they may face, to believe in their inherent strength and resilience. For it is through unwavering faith that true victory is achieved. As you stand amidst the ebb and flow of life's uncertainties, let not the whispers of doubt cloud your vision. Instead, let the assurance of your purpose resonate within you, guiding you forward with unwavering resolve. In its culmination, the script would offer not just comfort but a call to action, a reminder of the listener's divine purpose, their inherent worth, and the victory that awaits them. It would encourage them to view themselves through the lens of divine purpose, as masterpieces intricately woven with threads of resilience and grace, destined not merely for survival but for triumph. Fear not, for I am not a distant deity but a steadfast ally in your journey. With every step you take in faith, know that I am there beside you, orchestrating the symphony of your existence with tender care. Let us delve deeper into the essence of our connection with the Divine, a bond that transcends mere understanding and anchors our very being in a love that knows no bounds. If you are loving the God's message so far then please give us super thanks, as these videos take a lot of efforts and research to create them. And don't forget to join the channel membership to get the best from this channel. Picture, if you will, a garden at dawn, the first light of day caressing each leaf and petal, awakening the earth with a gentle embrace. This garden teeming with life is a testament to the divine's presence and the mundane, a whisper of the extraordinary in the ordinary. Within this garden of existence, we find ourselves seeking often unaware that what we seek is seeking us in return the Divine, in its infinite grace, reaches out to us in moments of silence, in the beauty that surrounds us, and in the warmth of human kindness. It's in these moments that we realize the Divine is not a distant entity, but a constant companion on our journey. Consider the lilies of the field, how they grow, they neither tore nor spin, and yet, I tell you, even Solomon in all his glory was not arrayed like one of these. This passage invites us to trust, to release our grip on the reins of control, and allow ourselves to be guided by a hand that moves with purpose and love. As we deepen our connection, we learn to listen more intently, not for a booming voice from the heavens, but for the soft murmurings within our soul, where the divine speaks in tones of peace and assurance. It is here, in the quietude of our hearts, that we receive the strength to face our doubts, armed with a faith that illuminates our darkest moments. As the narrative unfolds, let's delve into the essence of human struggle, the universal quest for meaning amidst trials, and the profound assurance that comes from a divine promise. It's a journey that echoes through the corridors of time, resounding in the heart of every person who has faced the night and yearned for the dawn. In your moments of solitude, when the silence around you becomes a mirror reflecting the turmoil within, remember the story of David, the shepherd boy who faced a giant not with the might of arms, but with the strength of faith.